Hello again. Uh, this is another book review. This time, um, this review is for those who are studying or want to study languages uh, from India. Okay, here I have this um, Lonely Planet phrase book. Uh, you've seen videos about the Lonely Planet um, collection before the series. I showed one for Thai in my Thai videos. And this is one, one that is special from Lonely Planet. Uh, the reason I say special is because it doesn't have only one language. It has a series of them. Here you have, let me see, Assamese, Bengali, Gujarati, Hindi, Canada, Kashmiri, Konkani, Malayalam, Marathi, Marawari, Oriya, Punjabi, Tamil, Telugu, and Urdu, with a bit of culture and history about all these languages. And uh, the guy that had the idea of putting all those languages together, it is a genius because it is awesome. As you can see, I personally love color coded stuff. So you can see here that each language has a color which is matched with the color of the edge of the page so you can easily look for a language here and then find the language right here okay the same language Malayalam Malayalam okay so what are some of the the good things about this book first thing is that they have the distribution map for the languages in India so you can look at a map and say and see where you're going and which language they speak there and for each language they have exactly the same pattern they have the alphabet let me show you a couple okay let's take the three first languages here so we have Assamese, Bengali and Gujarati you can see that first they have an introduction about the language and some social linguistics and then they have the alphabet introduction alphabet introduction alphabet okay and then of course like all the lonely planet books they have the different topics for it right and these are probably familiar with other phrase books too and then of course you have the english something in, in this case english assamese dictionary and this happens with every single language on this book okay each color here is a different language so you can tell how much material there is here but the most impressive feature that was pretty much pioneered in this book is that when you go to the index at the back and you're looking for one word it gives you see you have all the languages up here and it shows for example I'm looking for the word airport or something related to airport Let's see if I can get closer here let me get some definition come on okay a little better okay airport you look here and you have the different colors for the languages with the page number which will take you directly to the page where they talk about for example let's look look up airport stuff in Urdu, which is the language that I was studying uh, most frequently on this book. I studied a couple others, but Urdu was my focus. So let's go to page 352, which is pretty close here. 352, you have the transportation section. And the best part, you have the script and transcribed. I personally don't like books that don't have the original alphabet. So this is perfect. You have the English version, you have the original alphabet, and you have the transcription for every single language. Here, let's change it a little bit more. And then you have here too, and so forth. You have all, all this feature in this book. Another good thing is that the book is 
pretty thick for a pocket book, which is um, no, not too bad. We have 15 languages in in a book about the size that fits in your pocket. See, it's about the size of my hand, and it's only like 11 bucks new, brand new. This I used a little, so that's why it looks a little bit up. But it's a very good book if you wanna not only learn but compare the languages. This is a good source. Here you have like the basics, like yes, no, please, thank you, and I'm sorry. In all the languages, and it continues here in the back. Okay, so that's it. This is a very good source for Dravidian languages. Okay, the languages that are spoken in India. Okay. And that's it.